Hey, what is going on, YouTubies and YouTubettes? It's the Odd Job Prodigy here, here to bring you Odd Walkthrough number 13 of The Evil Within. I'm gonna be picking this one up right where I left off, so please enjoy. Oh, God, I gotta see what's down this hallway. Alright, so, uh, I had just paused the game for a second, so this is it. Oh, my God, there's another one. Jesus Christ, this place is crawling with them. Oh, and they have dynamite. Terrific. Of course, they have dynamite. What is this, a prison? Oh my god. Kidman, is she really worth saving? I mean, I don't know anymore. This is getting really hectic. Anyways, thank you guys for uh, tuning in. This is probably a new... Oh my god! I can't even commentate! I'm having to dodge dynamite. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. Oh, Jesus Christ. I have no idea what to do. Oh my god. Alright, what's over here? Oh my god! Oh god! It was dynamite there! Oh my god! Uh Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, God, here we go. This episode has not started off like I've wanted it to. This is way too fucking hectic to start an episode. Anyways, okay, so this is a new episode. In the last episode, we fought off an undead horde trying to save Kidman from a bath, strangely enough. And in this episode, we're trying to figure out on how to turn on or off valves or something in order to stop the never-ending water flow that's going into her tank that's not filling it up at all. As you can see in the top right, that's apparently the amount of time I have, and I just... I guess I just need to make it down this hallway? I don't know where I'm supposed to go yet. Don't throw that! No! Don't! No! No! Fuck! No! No! Gah! I'm splattered everywhere. God damn it. All right, I'm back. Oh, I probably sped through that part of something. You're not getting me again. I'm going under here. I think this is where I'm supposed to go. Finally, I made it down the hallway of hell, and now I'm going to... Okay. Yeah, we need to move. See, he's so fucking calm in these situations. Control panel. Oh, here we go. Yeah, a top one and a bottom one. All right. Oh, he told me. I thought I was going to have to guess something. All right. 22 on top. There we go. And then... Five on the bottom. There we go. Oh, oh, it's the other way. Shit. I probably just cut out 30 seconds of bullshit there. I, I went 18 instead of 22. I'm an idiot. Anyways, we saved Kidman. Nice. All right. Spent about, what, five episodes trying to find them and then save... Them. Oh, no. No. You're not doing this. No. Whoa. Oh, my God. God, again, this game is great, but it is some of the most repetitive shit. Alright, guys, welcome to the Evil Within. I need to save my friends again. Like I had... Okay, sorry about that. I had to cut that right there. 30 minutes of fucking searching. Alright. Anyways, I have to save my friends again. Ah, uh, that's gonna be a bitch. Oh, great. Where are we now? Every time I move forward in this game, I just get to a shittier and shittier place. Oh my god. I need to go to like a very girly, like, lackadaisical place after I make it out of here. If I make it out of here. I'll fucking go to like a, a coffee shop or something. Something mellow. Something where I can just sit down and relax and not have to see every fucking cliche horror shit. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. I honestly do not know where I'm supposed to go. Is there any way up? God, this game and its noises. It just. Wait, what was that? Was that something? That was something. This game just makes me feel like something is looking at me all the time. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at this. There's not going to be a jump scare here. No. Oh, shit. Look at that. I made it up. Nice. Oh, God. And the music and the ambiance are... Oh, shit. There's one. See, I can't even do commentary. There's always shit happening. Oh, my God. Oh, great. At least my headshot skills has not improved. Like, the last video I made, or should I say about an hour, shit, an hour ago, that was the first time I played The Evil Within in about six months, and my shot has actually gotten worse. Come on, die. Yes! All right. Perfect. Burn you. Pick up bullets. There we go. Pick up this thing. Oh, it's a grenade. Awesome. <laughs> we need more of those grenades. Those things have gotten me out of more sticky situations than I... I care to I care to elaborate on. Oh my god. Joseph, Kidman, where are you? I need to find you again. This has gotten pretty repetitive now. I'm I'm thinking of just ditching you two. Joseph? 
Are you down here? Oh god. Oh great. Yeah, let's let's descend deeper in the darkness. Oh god! Oh, back in AIDS. Nice. The Return of the AIDS. Episode 13, Return of the AIDS. Let's get out of there. Oh man, I really don't want to go in here. Joseph Kidman, is there any way you can too just like can just save yourselves? I mean, I've done a lot of work today. I mean, I'm a police officer. I do not get paid enough for this. I really uh, want to be home right now. I mean, my job is to protect and serve and everything, but this is, uh, I think this is a little beyond my payroll, if I do say so myself. Oh, great, and a checkpoint. That means some dangerous shit is, aww. Well, seems like I'm not the first stupid idiot to come down here and save their friends. That's good to know. And, you know when the game does a checkpoint and then it gives you a room that loads you up for something? Yeah, this is, uh, this is not a good time. This means that there's going to be something that I'm going to have to shoot at. <sighs> I just don't want to go down here. Alright, here we go. Fuck. Alright. Guys, pray for me. Oh, God. Oh, shit. What was that? Burn you. Can I burn? Yeah. Okay. That guy's not going to get up. Oh, God. Oh, shit. There's another one. Okay. Headshot. Yes! Finally, a good shot. Oh, man. Anybody who was watching this was probably just screaming at their screen wanting me to get a good shot. Oh, thank God. Finally. Oh, what's in this room? Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, come on now. What is that? What the fuck? That looks like a balled up piece of skin colored clay doh and somebody has stuffed paper clips in it. Jesus Christ. Paper clip boy. Oh, look, it's Joseph. Yes, thank you. I get help with paper clip boy. Oh, thank God he's dead. Do I at least get some brain goop for him? Come on. I want, I want some brain goop for that guy. That guy seemed tough. 100 brain goop come on now even the brain goop is cheaping me oh all right so i found joseph is kidman in there too i'm just trying to look around for some more ammo there's some all right i i'm sorry guys that i'm you know i'm wasting time trying to find ammo i know that's not the most entertaining thing but as i've said many times i like need it oh there, there's the kidman side. perfect sebastian Maybe we can lift this enough for Kidman to go under and open it from the other side. We're counting on you. All right. Oh, good. All right. Finally, we're letting her do something. At least now I don't have to do it all by myself. <laughs> Kidman just stopped for a moment. She's like, is this all you're going to open it up for me? She just stopped and looked at me. All right, perfect. Let's let her do the work. Come on, Joseph. Let's get out of here. Let's grab a beer or something. Come on. She'll be fine. She's tough. She got out of her bubble bath. I'm sure she'll be fine. Come on, open it up. Apparently, I'm just going to have to descend deeper and deeper into... Ow, Ow you hit me with the door. Thank you, Kidman. That was awfully nice of you. Ah, <sighs> How do I entertain myself? This place is pretty bleak. I need to find something to entertain myself. I'm glad you're yeah, this seems about right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm hearing everything you people are Maybe saying. Ah. Well, I mean, look at the bright side. We're in this... Oh, shit. What was that? Come on. I was just trying to enjoy the booty. Come on. Oh, my... Oh, my God. Again. What the... Oh, my God. Is that spider lady? Oh, come on. <sighs> this just keeps getting worse and worse, guys. I'm getting, like, nostalgic, like, scary nostalgic flashbacks of this game. Just in this level, I've had to deal with, uh... I've had to deal with his slow fucking running, my terrible shooting, guys with grenades, a balled up guy of Play-Doh with fucking, fucking paperclip shoved in him, and now the return of the spider lady. This is just great. I hate this game. So, that being said, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna keep playing it, because I'm an idiot. Alright, so, I don't know what my objective is now, I, I guess, oh god, what is this room? Oh, great, a mannequin. Well, at least I can have some fun while I'm in here, it seems. I guess my objective is just to find Kidman and Joseph again. That's going to be great. That's been my objective for the past... Since I've played this game, that has been my objective. That mannequin better not move on me. I swear to God. Wedding invitation. Detective uh, Sebastian Castellonis and Detective Mira Hansen joyfully request the pleasure of your company at their... Uh, their... At... 
What? Wedding celebration Saturday, 17th of September 2005 at half past nine. Saturday reception to follow. Whatever. All right. So apparently it's a wedding invitation for me and this other chick. That's great. I haven't found out what happened to her yet. There's a mirror. Let's go in the mirror. I have some. I have like almost 10,000 brain goop. I think I need to use that. Oh God. What is this? Every time I go back into this mirror, it brings me to a more precarious situation. What is this? I also have a theory that this nurse lady is somehow connected to this. Could she be my wife or something? Uh, I have no idea. Alright, I'm just going to upgrade. Let's see what I can do here. <laughs> if there is any way I can make Castellonis a little less sucky in terms of his abilities, then I'd love to do so. Uh, agony bolts, let's see here, explosive bolts, inflicts extra damage, nah, that's fine. Abilities, sprint time, uh, you know I want more sprint. Uh, melee damage, what do you guys think? I have no idea. I mean, I do some stupid shit in this game. Should I upgrade melee? Ugh, this is so tough. Oh, by the way, I'm going to try to get a regular uh, submission schedule to my videos. Try to get that back up to date, too. That's going to be very important. All right. So put one in there. All right. Life gauge. Should I do one in life gauge? I don't know. I'll just do that for now. That'll be good. All right. I think I'm done. I'll save the 3500 for another time. Now, how, that door is shut, so how do I... Do I get out of here? Nurse, can you help me? I'm lost. I don't know what to do. Oh, God. What's going to be in here? Guys, clinch your buttholes. This is this is going to be bad. I have a feeling there's going to be a huge jump scare going. Oh, boy. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I... So many new admissions and not a single discharge. I I mean, she she gives some hints, man. I, uh, you're just gonna you're just gonna walk past that, uh, nurse. I think one of your mental patients just opened their door. I think you might. Holy shit. Okay, well I've entered into the twilight zone. Fine. That's great. Fine. 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 Is that? Fine. Fine. What's his face? Fine. Fine. Oh God, I forgot his name. Fine. Fine. What's his? Oh, Fine. yeah, that's totally him. What's his name again? He had that pussy name, that girly ass name. What? What is it? Oh my god. Oh. You don't look well. Oh my god. Do what? What the hell? This game is bullshitting me. Oh, Leslie. That's right. That was Leslie. Oh, sorry about anybody named Leslie, by the way. It's not a girly name. But anyways, I think I'm going to leave this one here. I'll just save the game. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. I will see you in the next part. This game is getting really fucking creepy. Ah, uh, God. Bye, guys.